I guess it means uh, to not uh, be brave or anything like that, uh, like uh, courageous or anything. Bow down to uh, other people. I guess I would think of it as like someone's calling me weak, and uh, like it'd be like demasculizing. So like that's how I would take it. So like it'd be kind of like taking away from like what I consider <clears throat> like a masculine thing, they'd be like, oh, going against that. Good luck. Um, I guess that you got a lot of girls, but at the same time you take a lot of girl on your you know, skin, with your products and all that. Okay, and would you take offense to being called a pretty boy? Mm, I guess so, because it's implied that then you're metrosexual. Um, to be like really, really put together and concerned about how you look like all the time, and that's all that's on your mind. Bitch. Describe the act of a whining, whining excessively. Man, are you back? 135, man. Man, my sister could be such a bitch. I'm three, I'm four, I'm five, I'm six, I'm seven. How's this guy doing over here, man? Do you care if you dance on the ball? Do you care if you dance on the ball? Get your chest on the ball! Get your chest on the ball! Man up, definitely. Uh, am I allowed to swear? Pussy, I guess. <laughs> yeah. yeah, that one definitely. Yeah, sissy's definitely one. Um, Whim, there's ones like vulgar ones like pussy, like stuff like that. Like, um, pussy. <laughs> pussy ass. I mean, you guys, if someone called me a pussy ass, I'd be like, I feel like a little girl. <laughs> pussy. And why? Because it's a woman's term. If someone was to call me a pussy, I would feel like they're trying to take my masculinity away. Because it's perceived as more feminine and men try and be masculine and not feminine. Would you rather be called a pussy or a dick? Probably a pussy because a dick sounds mean and a pussy just sounds like you're a chicken. Um, well, because I think we associate sort of a degrading meaning behind those words and they're usually like feminized in like a pernicious way so when you call um, when you use those words for women it's seen differently than when it's used to describe men because of the way we've constructed how we use those words. Okay. Freaking sister can use those man. Come on guys I'm just doing my best. Six year old sister. Pansy, a sissy fag fairy or one that is generally unmanly. That guy hits like a girl. <laughs> what the hell? What a pansy. I bet Jack would kick his ass. Jack? Oh yeah. I mean, look at it. Looks like a girl as it is. If a man were to call another man a pansy, what would that imply? That they're weak. Uh, like, is that your mask? Yeah. Yeah, okay, well, I'm, I'm kind of busy later, so. Oh. Yeah. See you, see you later. Okay, <laughs> and what do you think is one word that would strip someone of their masculinity? Um, probably me. What's up, boys? Nice week. What's up, boys? Those tags are fine. Come on, man. Tags, guys. Up them up. Let's go. It doesn't really make a difference. I'm still late. What's up, you bitch? What are you on the bike for, eh? Pussy. Start doing some curls, you fag. Come on. Start doing some curls, you fag. Start doing some curls, you fag. Start doing some curls, you fag. What's your opinion on the word fag? Uh, fag is a derogatory term for a gay person.
I don't know. Like, I mean, why is it offensive? Why is it offensive? I think maybe because I don't know, it, it, it's kind of like an attack on uh, the other guy's uh, masculinity. They use it, the, the person who's calling the other guy gay, and it, it'd be taken as offensive. It's almost an attack on, their, on the other person's masculinity, and thinking that the person presumably would be putting that person down. I, I wouldn't consider myself that masculine. And why wouldn't you consider yourself masculine? Uh, I am quite effeminate, I think. Um, obviously, I think I'm gay. So I never really identified with being masculine or what it's like to be masculine. I think the first thing that pops into my head is, you know, rough, rugged, muscular, um, kind of emotionally vapid, I guess, if that makes any sense. I guess like being strong and like brave um, and like uh, kind of just being like not afraid of something. What do you think it means to be masculine? Uh, you like to work out and you dress more masculine. Oh god. Um. I don't know. God, uh... <laughs> I guess... I'm uh, being tough. Okay. Yeah. And um, I think it means to be like dominant and powerful and like in charge. I'm only human after all. I'm only human after all. Don't put your blame on me. Don't put the blame on me. Give it to me! Friggin' mom uses those <laughs> just aqua size. <laughs> oh, yeah. Sorry. Sorry. And now, what's a word that you'd use to strip someone of their masculinity? Pussy ass. <laughs> <laughs> I can't remember. How come? <laughs> How come you guys, if someone called me a pussy ass, I'd be like, I feel like a little girl. <laughs> um, God. Um. I don't know. God, uh. Yeah. 